Hey everybody, how's it going? This is RJ. I wanted to come and show you guys what I'm what I've been using for uh, the signals, posting uh, posting signals for my team. Exactly how I'm able to get great strike areas on these trends. Um, not only am I using the moving average uh, and this indicator here is a custom indicator called VQI. Um, not only am I using these to dictate exactly which trend to which trend uh, which way the trend is going I also use this moving average here to <clears throat> to tell me exactly when to strike utilizing not only the the moving average but utilizing uh, the L trend here for strike areas and utilizing the Fibonacci expansion and retracements okay what we see here is a current uptrend and I uh, took a trade here uh, how I was able to get that I took a trade earlier today on pound yen uh, right here on the 15 minute chart right in that area when it hit that moving average I uh, went in for um, uh, basically ten dollars per pip or one dollar per point for the uptrend okay what I did was I um, I practically you know just saw that it was close to the moving average during the opening of the US session and I went from the lowest low to the highest high of that of, of, of the day from this point here which is the low to the high and it gave me this area to strike for the buy I know that this is buying this is telling me clearly that it's buying I'm looking for a retracement back down to uh, this moving average to take my strike for the buy preferably below this uh, this indicator here the L trend below the L trend touching the moving average or below the moving average in these areas here in this area within these three lines I also have uh, whole numbers here uh, to also help me with striking uh, for uh, trended trades. Uh, so I've been really, really doing really well uh, with this setup. Uh, just basically using retracements uh, and, and, and expansion, the expansion to put the retracement here. And it also gives me this level here, right there for the buy off the moving average okay you can strike very very accurate trades and I've been calling very very accurate signals for the team uh, we roughly put a 25 pip stop loss for a 50 pip uh, or a 75 pip win um, the <clears throat> the ratio is one one to two and one to three um, the only way that you would do a one to three safely is if you catch the very first retracement uh, which in, in, in a sense was here uh, this came up to the high, retraced back down to the low here. This here you would take a one to three. So you would take your strike right in this area here. Uh, pref pr probably in this area here you would have taken your strike. You would have set your 25 pip stop loss back here. And you would have gone 25 pips, 50 pips, 75 pips on that trade. Sure, it would have taken you a few hours for it to, through this, excuse me, through this range here. It came back down, gave you another uh, opportunity to take a strike buy. It came back down here, gave you another opportunity to strike for the buy. And bam, one to three is hit. Okay, so <clears throat> um, I usually suggest on the second on the second retracement wave, you get one here, and you get another one here. Take a t one to two. So you're taking about 50 pips, 25 pips stop for 50 pips. Okay, um, so <clears throat> um, it's been working very, very well, um, and the team is very happy. I just pushed this out yesterday for the team, and they've been asking a lot of questions about um, certain things with regard to, especially the moving average uh, uh, this morning. Uh, the moving average was in a sell. The moving average looked like it was selling, but this was clearly telling us buy, so um, I had them to take a buy. Don't don't take a sell, but take a buy. This is on the Euro USD this morning, and um, and everybody came out in profit on on that buy trade this morning. So I just wanted to um you know push this out and, and let you guys take a look at um uh, there are no arrows here. Um the arrow the only arrows we do have arrows here to give us added confirmation on the trend. You're not trading that arrow because that arrow repaints. You're just looking at that after the fact and you see it coming back up here. 
buying back towards the moving average, you're like, okay, this is selling. This is to saying it's clearly selling. Even though the overall trend is uptrend, the current trend is downtrend. So you would definitely take a sell here. Definitely take a sell there. And that will be a three to a one to three because you're taking the first retracement on the sell. That's the first retracement back up. If you take a sell here and you take a uh, take, you know, take your one to three, basically take 75 pips off that and be happy. OK, so um, with this, I'm just, you know, putting this push, just push this out to the team yesterday. Uh, I'm also calling signals off this and they're also able to finally be able to see what I see regarding uh, taking trades during uh, trend retracements. All right. Um, if you want to have, uh, if you want to gain access to the system here, you can join us on Tomsey Group Lines Trading. Tomsey Group Lines Trading here, and um, this is the public group on Facebook. Uh, I also have a private group where I push out the signals and push out this system uh, for them to trade uh, on on their own. Um, and we also look into have everybody work together to push out push out uh, push out trades that they see in case I'm not I'm not at the computer to see it I want everybody to, to help each other out uh, with when to come in on trades okay uh, again you can join us on Tommy's group lines trading uh, this is the public group uh, to gain access to uh, the the system here and also signals all right, thank you again for watching, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.